I got you now. No! You beat me up. I'm out. Oh. You take my place. Hi, everybody. Oh, you didn't like that, did you? So, today we're going to be talking about the top 10 things to do in top Okinawa. Top 10 out. Things to do. So this list isn't in any particular order at all. We literally just took the list, wrote down the top 10 things that we like doing while we're here. These are places that we've been, places that we go to often. A couple of these we don't go to that often because they're sightseeing places, but I think there's only two, two maybe. But one of the things on our list is Manga Soko. Yeah. He has trouble saying it. Tell him how you say it. Your mom. No. <laughs> Stop. He, he, he likes to say Manga Shoko for some reason, but it's, it's Manga Soko. It basically means manga warehouse, kind of, like like a store. It, it's, a, it's like a warehouse, but it's not. It's a, it's a little otaku place. Mm, yeah. If you like to go... And get figurines, manga, if you can read Japanese. Um, we like to go often to get uh, figurines and play the little crane games that they have in there. It's a really good spot to go. Uh, the staff in there, most of them understand English. So if you do need help in there, you can easily call on somebody and they'll, they'll understand what you mean. Some of them don't know English, but they will find somebody who speaks English for you. American Village. American Village. American Village. It's one of the best places to go here. It's on, it's Ch Ch Chatan, right? Yeah, Chatan. Chatan. And I would highly recommend when you go, bring yen. Not all the places there accept card, but most do. Bring yen, because there's some places there, like, um, like ramen places. It's a coin machine where you put money in, and then a little ticket comes out, and you've already paid for your food. You give them their ticket. They make your food, bring it to you. Great places in American Village. It's a little shopping district. There's a little mall there. Um, a lot of places to eat. Uh, taco. There's a taco rice place upstairs in American Village. If you can find it, it's great. I don't know the name of it off the top of my head, but it is amazing. Uh, another good place to go is Ryukyu Mura. I, I can't say that one. <laughs> That place accepts card. It is historical event place. Yeah, basically, it's like it's an old village in Okinawa, and you go. There's an area where you can learn how to play shamisen, which is like a little banjo kind of instrument. Okay, boy. <laughs> go over there. Go over there. We're trying to record. It's like a little, ah. it's like a little banjo instrument. You go in there. They have shows. There's a guy in drag. He's awesome. He dances. Uh, a couple, Sometimes there's this, uh, what's the big rope? The, the, it's a, it's, oh, the giant tug of war they it's do? It's the big giant tug of war. They do it one, once a year, right? Yeah, uh, I think, I it's, I think it's once a year. It's for a special occasion. They'll pull it out and they do the tug of war I thing. I don't know what to do there. I'm not 100% sure. I know they use it for that, though. And... Don Quixote, when, Don you're in, when you're in Okinawa, is a must. In Japan in general, it's all over Japan. You need to go to Don Quixote. And specifically in Okinawa, it's the only place where you can get the uh, Sata, Sata Andagi, I think is how you pronounce it, which is Okinawan donuts. You want to explain what the Okinawan donut is? No, they're just good. They're really good. They're just good. It's, it's a little round donut. Uh, it basically tastes like a funnel cake. Oh, and nice. sometimes it has cream inside of it and they're really, really good. And you have to try those when you come here. Don Quixote is basically like Walmart. I want to say it's like Walmart. It's like a cramped Walmart. Yeah, it, yeah it's like a cramped it's Walmart. It's got a section for groceries. It's got a section for like clothing and stuff, and then it's got a weird section. <laughs> it, it's got a lot of stuff in there. Anything that you can think of, something that you need in Okinawa, it, it's there. In Japan in general, it's there. Don, Don Quixote is an amazing place. 
Another place I would highly recommend we go there all the time, probably once, twice a week sometimes, depending on if we feel like going out. We go to the uh, Aeon Mall in Okinawa. Well, it's Aeon Mall Okinawa Rikom. That specific one is huge. It's got an aqu a little aquarium in it. It's well, the biggest one in Okinawa. It's the biggest mall in Okinawa. Yes, it's the biggest mall. And the aquarium, when I say it's an aquarium, I mean like, it's not huge, it's not tiny, but it's like, it, it's still pretty big though. Yeah, the biggest one I've seen in the mall so far. Yeah. In a mall, it's big. And there's plenty of shops in there. It's the only one, I believe, in Okinawa that has a Pokemon Center in it. And a Sanrio store, I believe. Yeah, Sanrio's actually. And the Ghibli. They have Studio Ghibli store. Is there? Oh, I forgot. Was it, what was yeah, it called again? It's because it has My Neighbor Totoro oh, stuff in it. It has, it has oh, Ghibli it has stuff Ghibli. in it. Okay. And downstairs, towards the back of the mall, um, I, can't, I can't really explain what it is, but it's like pop-up stalls. People come in and they sell foods, items, and all kinds of things. Just last week we went and I got a shikawasa drink and it was okay. so, 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 so good. And for Valentine's Day, they opened it up for White Day as well. You can go in and get a treat, like candy and stuff for your loved one. So that was awesome. I was able to buy some stuff and made him some chocolate, some cute Rila Kuma. I did the green green tea chocolates for him and he really loved them. Oh yeah, those were good. I don't remember. I'm like, what? what <laughs> the green tea about? ones and the caramel ones and the white chocolate ones. They're I really did good. those. Yeah, they're pretty good. And yeah, thank you for this. oh my goodness, one of the best places to go eat. If you are vegan, I highly recommend you try this place. It's uh, Gub Gubs. So as of editing this video, I did a check on Gub Gubs to get more information on food pricing and whatnot. And it turns out According to Google that they are permanently closed. I'm not 100% sure if it's just temporary or if it is indeed permanent, but yeah, it's just a little update for you guys. I'm sorry. Hi, boy. He smells the chocolate. No, I eat chocolate. It's, uh, just give me kisses. Oh. And another place, Kokusai Dori which basically means International Road. We just call it Kokosai Street because Dory basically means street or, or road. Or Kokosai Dory's yeah. shopping street. If you go That's there, what it pops up on Google Maps. If you go Maps. there, bring yen. They do not accept card in most of the places. No, they do. They do. Not in most. Down, mm. down the main street, they're mostly pop-up shops. So oh, are you talking about the ones in the alley? In the alley. Uh, it's like a 50-50. Yeah, bring yen. Just bring, just, just bring yen. Bring yen. And yeah. if you don't have yen on you when you go, there's a Lawson's there. You can you can pull out yen. Lawson's. It was Family Mart. Was it Family Mart? It was family. Uh, it's probably one of one of the two. <laughs> you can go in there, pull out money, and you can buy lots of goods. They mostly have uh, what's it called? Um, hmm. sou souvenirs and stuff. They do souvenirs. It's a bunch of food. souvenirs. Right? If you're gonna eat in there, they do have vegan vegetarian options because they do, uh, what is it called? The little fruit on the stick thing? I don't know, fruit on a stick. It, it's basically <laughs> fruit on a stick. I'm it, not gonna know most of these things yeah. you asked me because I forgot. And they do have the, um, oh, is this your... they do have yeah, uh, the Okinawan donuts there as well. Those ones Go are fetch. different flavored, so they're not just gonna taste like um, funnel cake. They're gonna they have banana flavor, coffee, uh, Cinnamon, they cook pineapple. They have pineapple flavored ones if you like pineapple. Uh, and yeah, and then just recently we went and he tried the uh, pork tomago onigiri. That's what the place is called. Oh my god, you that place is. Explain it? I can't really explain it because the place is just really delicious. So it's basically, you know, you ever had spam masubi? But uh, if you ever had spam masubi, it's kind of like that. but. Yeah, well, but the said just uh, seaweed in the middle is just all around. It's like a delicious sandwich. And uh, believe it or not, they're pretty big for their size. You so, think they're smaller? Because, you know, normally yeah. onigiri is kind of kind of small. So you'd think it would be small, but it's it's not. It's like two Fitch. onigiri next to each other in size, basically. It's, it's big. And did they have English-speaking staff there? They do have English-speaking staff. So, yeah, yay. no way. 
Hang on, I gotta, I gotta beat up my buoy. And <laughs> it, it's called po, uh, pork tamago onigiri because that's exactly what it is. Pork, which is the spam, tamago, which is egg, <laughs> and onigiri, which is the rice and seaweed. It's so, not only pork, there's other options yeah. there too. I didn't go yeah. in, so I, and, I didn't know. Okay, well, Mark didn't, <laughs> and across the street from it is where you can eat because oh, the yes. place is small. Um, you just turn around and go go one shop over. Yeah, if you want any yeah. drinks with it, it's like a, like a two dollars or more or less. Can't really know in yen. But there's but, a vending uh, machine right next. Yeah, to Yeah, right it. next to the place is it. So everything for a buck. Yeah, if you yen. don't want to pay for a drink, you can just use the vending machine, which there are vending machines everywhere in Japan. So if you drink prices are kind of pricey in restaurants, so if you don't want that option, just get a drink from a vending machine. <laughs> Boy, you rude. You rude, fat boy. I got you now. No! You beat me up. I'm out. Oh. You take my place. He's the next newscaster for me. And Hello, another place me. here, it was one of the first places I got to go to. It was the Southeast Botanical Gardens. It is really close to here, actually. The Botanical Gardens is really, really nice inside. Well, before you go inside, I believe it's before you go inside, they have the bug museum. The, the oh, beetle museum. I, they might have changed that during seasons. I am not sure. But they it was the beetle museum when we went. And it was we didn't get to go in because it was a little pricey. I, I think it was like $10, $15 per person to Stop. go in. And so at that moment, we just we were like, oh, well, we'll just skip it, save it for next time. And when you, zoo there too. Yes, when you go inside, there is a petting zoo. There are goats. Uh, the little, I don't remember what kind of monkeys they are, but they're the tiny, tiny monkeys. Oh, there's monkeys there? You don't remember the monkeys? Yeah, there was tiny monkeys. And they also monkeys, had uh, capybara. You oh, can yeah. pet the capybara. They're so cute. It's one of my favorite animals. You can remember for the yen box donation, you can yes. feed them a dollar. There is a box right next to the food, so please be sure to drop yen in there. It'll tell you how much it is. It's usually 100 yen. And you take a food cup and you can feed, you can hand feed the animals. Boy. Same with the koi. There was a section for the koi. And you could uh, use a machine and it'll crank you out some food and you can feed the koi there as well. And it's it's really pretty there. It's beautiful. You can do that in Yukimura too. There's a, um, there's a little bus too if you want to ride on the little bus and it'll take you around the whole park. Like, it's, it's really nice. And another place to go to would be the Kurozushi, which is our favorite. Kurozushi? Oh, yeah, oh, no, no, no. Our sushi place. The sushi place. That place is really It good. is uh, mm. conveyor belt sushi. It is a chain around Japan in general. But in Okinawa, I really like ours. It's big. And yeah, like, the sushi prices are really, really, really cheap. Like, most of it, the plates are 100 yen. Yeah, most of the time, yeah, yeah. this is the special menu, and you can order from there because it's a little touch iPhone tap mm. thing. I don't know what it is. It's just a touch screen thing. Yes, and you can choose what language uh, you want. I think they have Chinese as an option, Japanese, and English. Maybe, uh, maybe. Maybe it was more. I didn't really look at it. I don't much. really look. Usually, I just open it and press English, but uh, there are other language options if you need, and the staff... The staff speaks English, so usually there's one girl in there I think who speaks English. <laughs> so usually, if you go in and you look you foreign, they will start uh, spouting off the numbers if there is a wait in English. So it it does help a lot uh, for them to be able to do that. When you go in, there's a machine you press. Uh, you press the button for the table or booth. Oh yes, yes. They they'll tell you mm. the instructions in the front. Yeah. It, it, It'll tell you how to put it in, but usually there is a wait, especially on the weekends in the afternoon. But if you go, if you go before dinner, anytime usually before Ugh. dinner, they are open and you can usually just walk in, but you still, you still need to pull a number unless they tell you otherwise. But most of the time when we go, they're kind of busy and the wait is usually about an hour on the weekends in the afternoon. Yeah, it it's really like depends. An hour to two yeah. hours. It just depends on how many people are out that day. Yeah, it really depends on the group. But the good thing about it is it's right next to the uh, mall. Uh, don't kick me. Literally, the Aeon Mall and the building are like a couple oh, feet, yeah, like their feet yeah, from right. each other. 
really so nice. you can go upstairs pull your ticket check your wait time if your wait time is between like an hour to two hours go go right next door go to the mall hang out in the mall for a bit that's what we usually do and it's awesome it's upstairs in a little building so you got to make sure to go upstairs or you won't see it and it's it's, it's really, really can't really miss it it's right next to this place called uh, it's, it's right next to the Daiso. There's the uh, Torij and Shish, not Sushi, Ramen, the like yeah. empty place where you elevator next to. What was in there again? It's, if you see the Daiso, go yeah, right was, around yeah. the corner it's, it's and like, it's right there. No, upstairs. no, what's the what's the um store below that? And we're singing Kojima. it for Kojima. Was it Kojima? Kojima. Oh yeah, it was Kojima. Uh, Kojima, Kojima Drugs? Um, another place to go would be round one. I know we've already done a video on round one. Seven so floors of goodness! It's a lot of fun. We took his friend there recently, and his friend absolutely loved it. Lightning! <laughs> Lightning! They Lightning. did. They did change their um, for the, for upstairs. They did change the system now to go in. You have to uh, use a machine. <laughs> there is a guy who speaks English there for you, so he can help you. I'm pretty sure soon the machines will have an English option, but as of now. Of making this video as it's uploaded there is no english option on the machine you need to ask for help if oh, you don't know japanese explain the floors the first and second floor is just yen you put yen game machines on it they're really Mr. cheap D. they're really cheap too yeah they're all like everything at the casino over there it's like 100 plus. 150 yen usually yeah. for the machines so. 150 yen you're tripping it's a, it's a dollar she's tripping it's 100 yen <laughs> Then well, if you example. do the gambling stuff i think it's more there there is gambling she's too tripping. it's coins <laughs> But uh, yeah, the third floor is darts, bowling. Mm -hmm. Fourth floor is relaxation room. Really can't go to that floor unless you go to the sixth floor, mm -hmm. which you have to pay, was it 20 bucks for 90 minutes? So it was Three like, hours for like... I think it was 1500 per person. 1500? No, 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 no. Well, I'll, like ins 19th, I'll insert so, the prices. Yeah. <laughs> right. yeah. But other than that, after you hit pay, pay on the sixth floor, then you can fourth, go fifth, to the fourth, seventh, fifth, and seventh. It's all free after you pay for that. Yes, yeah. all games free for as long as you want. Now, I would recommend if you are playing the games, if there are people behind you, technically, yes, you can stay there as long as you want, but be kind and take turns Ten with minutes. people. <laughs> yeah, unless you're playing uh, Ten what fi Final Crisis, you can probably Final what, Final Crisis. What, what's the name of the game? Oh my. <laughs> Time, time Crisis. Jesus. <laughs> That's not the only game. There's more games yeah, than that. Yeah, but if, if you play Time Crisis, it's got like three stages to it. They all take a long time. You can stay there and play until you beat the whole thing if three you want stages. to. Yeah. Just but like if go you're, to the room. If you're doing DDR or right something, now. play your turn. Let somebody else on. Just be very nice about it. And the... What? It's chasing fairies. It's okay. Don't touch my devil's that boy. And the, um... 70 degrees in this house only. 70 degrees! And the floor with the uh, darts and whatnot. Be yeah, sure... Floor, floor. Is that the floor? No, which floor is it that has the... Uh, the baseball. Baseball? Mm. Seventh floor. Seventh floor, be sure everything, 10 minutes. You can use the timer if you don't... No, it's, what, it's, it's, it's not 10 minutes, it's one game, it's two games. Total. After but that. Some of them are limited to 10 minutes. Like uh, arch Soccer, archery, archery, you can only get 10 minutes. Basketball, 10 minutes. Basketball? Uh, I don't know if I, I think so. And they Maybe. have volleyball too. And you can rent uh, Man, You can rent hoverboards on the seventh floor. Uh, Segway drift. Yeah. <laughs> Those little Segway shoes. You I'm kind of scared to do that. I'm afraid I don't think that I, would do I that. will fall and hurt myself. Yeah. Like for sure. And he's messed up his wrist, so I'm pretty sure. I have a metal plate in my wrist right now. Yeah. That's that why we really haven't been making videos recently because he was in the hospital. Sorry. No, I was really fat and lazy. <laughs> that, she she got the past three months. So I was like, fine, I'll do it. And what's the next one? Those were the top oh. ten places that we recommend. But oh. then we also do have a couple honorable mentions, which I won't be able to give too much detail about. But I just really wanted to include them in the video. Cozen oh, Vegan Night Market. Bring yen. Bring yen with you. It is only cash. It, they only have it on Friday, but it's one Friday a month. <laughs> I, I never noticed. I just she, uh, if you if you go on their website on their Facebook, it will tell you when they're doing it. So if you're gonna be in Japan and you're gonna be here, 
during a Friday, please, please be sure to try and go to Cosa Vegan Night Market. It's really, really good homemade vegan food. And, like, it's just, it's really good. Like, I can't explain how good it is. <laughs> Gub Gubs like is there. Gub Gubs is usually there, too. So if you're not able to catch Gub Gubs, but you're able to catch him on Cosa Vegan Night, go for it. He makes burgers for the Cosa Vegan Nights. There's beer there, too. Yes. You can get change for uh, your... If, if you bring big bills, they won't be able to accept the big bills, sadly, but you can go to the bar that's in the building. You can get the change through that bar. I got ginger ale, you know, so we could get some change in. It works out great. So. I was getting a lot of beer. Yeah, don't, don't, <laughs> don't bring big bills because <laughs> they're, they're small little places. They, they don't accept huge bills. Like, I want to say like... Fifty and above? Uh, Fifty. Ten, ten's a good change. I would recommend using, I'd recommend using 1,000 yen, usually. Just do, do your $10. bills, do, use your bills in 1,000 yen, and you, you should be fine. Uh, Starbucks, everybody knows Starbucks in Japan is amazing. Go try them. There's one in the Aeon Mall. There's plenty of Starbucks all over Okinawa, Japan. They have the limited edition Japanese drinks. If you would like to try them, they are here. So, but basically so she's saying Starbucks, unlimited drinks here in Japan all the time in every season. Not yes. unlimited drinks. Unli Did I say unlimited? Yeah. My bad. Limited drinks. Limited edition drinks. Limited. And another option to go to on our honorable mentions list, Esparza's Tacos and Coffee. AKA and TC. They take cash. English speaking staff. They take card too. Yeah, card, card. I meant to say card. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, <laughs> they take cash. They take card. And of course they take cash. <laughs> yes, they take card, ma the major cards, like MasterCard, Visa, they take all that. And they uh, do have English-speaking staff. The guy who runs the place, he is, he's American, right? I believe he's American. I don't know. It's delicious. He, the food <laughs> Once there, again, best know. tacos you'll ever have. Again, it is a vegan place. So you go in there, get some vegan uh, well, not vegan because it's, well, it's fish there too, and there's still meat and other options. So it's like, it's yeah, like, but the it's vegan menus yeah. available or vegetarians too. So yeah, it's like 50 50 there. You could choose a lot of yeah, things. Yeah, I like, I like getting the uh, steak tacos. <laughs> yeah. Not a lot of people see this, but there is coffee there. It's on the yes, right side of it. That's why it's called tacos and coffee. Everyone just get tacos. <laughs> they, just, they just recently changed their uh, times and stuff. So oh, if yeah, you go yeah, in the morning, they do have brunch now. Sea Wall is located in American Village. We'll just get down there. Did we already talk about it? We did talk about American Village. Where? I don't see it. I'm sorry. We have this thing because we're trying to get scripted. It was number two. <laughs> number two? Okay. I'm sorry. I don't. I forgot. But the Sea Wall, if you go just a little bit further down from American Village, you really can't miss it. Just just go towards the ocean. <laughs> sea Wall there. Nice. Beautiful. It's and behind really, there, really like, pretty. Nice. There's shops. a lot of food options over there as well. Bring cash just in case, because I'm not sure if some of those places do accept card, but most of them over there do. American Village, usually, it allows card. Next! Shitty Castle. Shitty Castle. They do take card there. Um, I don't know about the souvenirs there, but... Yeah. England, I don't really... I wasn't sure about that, because I didn't really buy no souvenirs there. We used... We used yen when we were there yeah, anyway, because we, we had a lot of yen on us, so we used yen. So we're not 100% sure on if they take card at all the souvenir shops. I think they do, but don't quote me. <laughs> Bring yen. They do take card in the front entrance, though. Yes, they do. When you go in, um, there's English-speaking staff there as well. They're really kind and yeah. But when you go through the castle, uh, you come out the other side and you can go um, in the back area. We'll let it take over. And that's where I first discovered Shikawasa, best thing in Okinawa, Japan, there are lemon lime things. <laughs> it's basically an Okinawan lime and they're grown here. They're really good and yeah, I recommend going. Especially go to Shuri Castle in the summer. It's really pretty. <laughs> He's a good boy. Nigga, this is my fat boy. This is Yuki. He's a sexy boy from the sexy boy clan. And he's a big troublemaker. That's all I have. I'm out!
Thank you.